Hello and welcome. This is a short introduction to Applied Political Economy Analysis, also known as APEA. This video will explain what Applied Political Economy Analysis is and why projects may benefit from using it. So, what is APEA? APEA helps project staff understand the interests and incentives that explain the decisions and behaviours of key actors in their sector, geography or system. APEA allows project teams to explore what motivates individuals or institutions to behave or make decisions as they do. The incentives that drive these actions may be political, social, economic or personal. Put simply, APEA is an analysis of why things are the way they are in a particular place and time. But what things does APEA examine? The answer to that question is very important because it will focus the analysis and make it more manageable. APEA is not just an analysis of the context. Project staff probably understand their context such as the stakeholders, laws and current events reported in the media. Your project team probably already knows and tracks this basic information about the context. APEA is about understanding why the current situation or context exists. If your project does not have this foundational understanding, you may need to start with a basic contextual analysis. APEA will not be able to help teams understand why a situation exists if they do not yet understand what the situation is. For example, project staff working on social accountability in the health sector may know what the formal and informal accountability processes are, who is involved in them and how they generally work. APEA can help them analyse why those processes function or don't function as intended. It can also help show the barriers and opportunities that make those processes more or less effective. When project staff understand the answers to these why questions, programming can be more effective. APEA may sound very theoretical. So how can project staff use it to improve their work? by helping them decide how to invest their limited time and resources in a way that is strategic and politically smart. If staff understand the incentives and power dynamics that affect their project, they can identify where there are opportunities for change and where change will be blocked. APEA often shows opportunities and barriers that were previously hidden or misunderstood. Staff can then decide the most strategic ways to approach opportunities and navigate barriers. APEA starts with a question, or few questions, that will support strategic decision making, rather than a question that is just interesting intellectually. The main question should help project staff make practical decisions about investments of time and resources. For example, one, which government officials are more likely to move reforms forward on your project's issues? 2. What advocacy messages speak to the interests of decision makers? 3. What types of community groups or leaders serve as gatekeepers or champions on key issues? Done well, APEA can help reveal previously hidden dynamics. A packed Zimbabwe staff person explained. APEA helps to determine what is realistic or not. It is one thing to say the traditional chief is interested in better health and education for all. But it is another thing entirely to know that he owns private schools or health clinics in the district. Knowledge of hidden interests will change the way you engage with people outside the project and may mean that you need to change your approach to getting local support. So, in summary, APEA is an analysis of why the status quo exists. In other words, 
It helps explain why things are the way they are. It is an approach for understanding the interests and incentives that explain the decisions and behaviours of key actors. APEA can help staff working in any sector to navigate and make visible the often hidden incentives that have a bearing on their project's ability to achieve change. And completing an APEA exercise can be a step toward intentionally monitoring the changing context in which your project is implemented over time. If you want to learn more about how to plan for and begin an APEA, watch our second short video. If you'd like to learn more about APEA, PACT has many resources available to guide teams through an APEA. PACT's APEA Handbook provides a detailed overview of the methodology with examples from around the globe and guidance for designing and executing APEA studies. PACT's APEA Toolkit helps teams self-assess whether APEA is the right tool for their project's needs, whether this is the right time to conduct an APEA and offers other tools to streamline the APEA process.